And it's yet another exciting time on the One King Show. We are bringing you Celeb Central. You know what happens each and every time we get seated on Celeb Central. We bring you interesting conversations from your favorite people. And tonight, I am being joined by the ever bubbly and ever beautiful. I will mention her name. Kindly subscribe to our social so you don't miss the conversation. We are coming your way with our socials at One King Multimedia on all social media handles. My name is Hetty, and the show is proudly sponsored by One King Mineral Water. And tonight, joining me in the studio, I'll call her small by my teeth. Yes. <laughs> First time seeing her, <laughs> I'll call her small but mighty. Her voice, oh my God. The aura, personality, the anointing, the overdue. So. <laughs> Welcome, Lady Joy. Thank you, Hetty. It's, it's a pleasure seeing you. I always see you on the altar, and it's like you're an <laughs> angel on the altar. I'm like, hey. Or trouble for Gabriel. How can I? <laughs> how can I talk to her? But today, it's it's a pleasure to have you in our studios. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you too. And I know it's been a long journey coming, Lady Joy Ministry. <laughs> yeah. Walk us through that. Uh, it's not been easy, but I will always say it's just God's grace. Mm. It's been God's grace, uh, God's word that we encourage ourselves with. Nice. That has brought us thus far. Mm. And also some fathers and mothers in the ministry who keep on encouraging us, helping us, supporting us. I think that's why. We, we've, we've, we've come, come this, far. this far. Nice. And how many years have you been doing music? Uh, since secondary school. Since wow. Secondary what school? school? Uh, straight to secondary school. school. Nice. Nice. <laughs> any position, entertainment, prefers or something? Oh, and, uh, I didn't actually hold any position in school. Wow. You just loved to sing. Yes. And it's part of the SU team. Mm. Uh, so when it comes to the singing part, I'm always there. I was there. Trumpet of Christ, Vice President. Nice. You're in my year. I remember it was during my time that SU Niguye. Meme batch. Meme batch. SU collapsed in my school. Because they come and then we tell them, what are people forcing us? It's like they were forcing the SU on us. So we decided that to know SU. And we collapsed the SU. Oh. But oh. today... We look back and, and we, we, thank, we thank our mothers, our fathers, you know, for instilling Christianity and then the word of God in us. And uh, we are who we are by the grace of God. Thank God. Lady Joy Ministries. Yes. I want to understand something. Okay. So every gospel musician has a ministry. Um, others see it as a ministry. Others also see it as an industry. Mm. So it depends on how you see it. For me, when it's a calling, it becomes a ministry. Wow. More than an industry. Mm. That's to mm. me. That's nice. And to me, I see it as a calling. As a calling. Are we um, to expect you to have a church or anything like that sometime or your singing alone as your form of ministry? Okay, God takes the lead. Mm. I follow. So whatever he brings up in the course of our journey, mm. I will gladly accept. Nice But one. for now, I don't intend to have a so church. So for my major. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's intend. look at the journey so far. How has the support been from media people, industry players, colleagues, church members, friends and family? How has the support been? Oh, okay. It's been amazing. Mm. It's been amazing, especially in Takrade. Wow. Second in Takrade, it's been amazing. Western region, particularly, mm. it's been amazing. The support from the media, you know, uh, when it comes to Takrade, they understand embracing this. Wow. If it is this, they will embrace it. I think other people share different mind. opinions to this one. Maybe you're so uh, lucky. It's grace. Let me say it's grace and favor. That is fine. I guess. <laughs> I so guess. the support in their own small way, they do their best. Nice one. From having media mm, right to church. Nice one. Haven't you encountered any, you know, uh, negative experience or anything like that where at times it, it made you feel like you're tired? I might want to relocate <laughs> or I just want to give up. Uh, I've had those experiences. I've actually had those experiences where you wish, uh, mm. 
Mm. But you know, uh, can you give us one, or what? 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 What could have led you to that stage? Oh, sometimes uh, you expect a particular group of people or someone to come through for you. Yes, and then you call on them, and they turn their backs on you. Wow. Uh, sometimes uh, it's discouraging. It's it says that you're not in your clan or cartel, so maybe. Uh, I always say that uh, it should be a. It should be. Sometimes God allows those things, and then it, it brings other people on board. Mm. Just for you to know that. And what's our duration? Nice one. So. Yeah, he's always educating and making us know that his words are true. So the last time I had a conversation with Nava. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Nava is actually my my classmate. Do you oh, know? Oh, I see. Yeah. So he started singing. He used to sing love songs. <laughs> <laughs> So I had a sit-down conversation with Nava, and he brought it out that in the gospel fraternity, there are clans and cartel, and groups and squad, and this squad, this squad. I'm like, ah, I thought the other people would do not. He says, yes, there are people, so these people will support these people, these people don't support. I'm like, okay. Now, I'm not listening to only you. Yeah. I want to hear other musicians also tell this. Have you ever felt that there are groups within groups or associations within associations in the gospel fraternity? Uh, I will say it's everywhere. Oh, no, we are not talking everywhere. <laughs> Joy, the way you are, it's, it's like, everywhere. It's like, you are talking as if you are walking on the roadside. I mean, no, ah. No, there's okay. no roadside. This is a room. So you are safe. Oh, I am safe here. Okay, you tell only, tell only me. Uh, are there groups in the gospel fraternity? It be wrong, but ah. yeah, can you hear boom? Yeah, I believe one day it will get better. It will get better. Because I sometimes see, you know, some of your colleagues, some are better when they are talking. That's eh, this people, when this group are doing their show, they don't put you on, or they have their people, they put them on. This one won't go for this person's event. I'm like, oh, hey, eh, the, the, the conversation is preaching Jesus. Why are people fighting? Uh, I don't see it that way. For me, for instance, before my, my program, a year, fancy, 2024, and I'm in program. 2023, I start praying about it. Mm. I look at what I want, I pray about it, and then I ask God to help me choose those I want to bring mm, on, board on board to make what God wants us to do that very time nice so i don't think it's a salmon me me who is that nice sendi panu here or shana near eradi the amount whatever you have and a bbnam swa or the best friend mean jindy say a cartels and uh but have you experienced sabotage in your field of work sabotage mm. not really not really no is it no or not really but Nice. Mm. It's, it's all been good. Say, if I'm supposed to be there, I'll be there. Mm. If I'm not to be there, I must not be there. That's why I'm not being called or mm. I'm not there. Mm. So I won't always relate it to mm. sabotage. Nice That's one. me. We, we have a major program coming tomorrow, and I, I just cannot wait. Yeah, then I will go to the program. But you know that <laughs> sitting with you, I just definitely know you need to pull a string or two. Yeah. I've seen this. Um, for how many years have you been doing your 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 event? Awakening Experience. Uh, this is the third edition. This is the third edition. Yeah. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Congratulations to you. Not Thank everyone you. survives after the first one. <laughs> now, I, I want to find out from you. It looks like a lot of gospel artists, not only the Western region, yeah. these days now all want to have annual event. Almost, not almost, but most. It looks like it's becoming a common thing in the yeah. gospel fraternity. This one has this event every year. Yeah. Uh, what uh, is I happening? Think, I, I think one uh, one other media personality, uh, if you don't mind, I can mention his name, uh, Feeling Daddy, also yeah. asked me, okay. uh, Joy, that's will be a more year program. No, it will year, be a year program. program. Um, menu, I would say that and there's a burden the Lord laid on my heart. Mm. Gather my people. I want to have a garden with my people, a visitation, that people will be revived. 
people would be awakened. Their first love would be awakened. People would come to love God the more. So it's about that. And I don't see it as a program. I was said they be a me. Say, Eradi de Basse and ya would do it. I used to host one other before awakening experience. Okay. That was the secret place. Okay. It was out of the secret place the Lord laid Gave it. Gave you another. To make it this big. Okay. To have this kind of, formerly it used to be just few people. And the impacts, the testimonies that comes out of it. So each year and what God wants us to, to do, do at that gathering. It's me, me, who is it? A program, program. I believe it's a gathering. Nice. And a gathering of the saints to meet their God. That's all. Nice one. And uh, most of these, um, you know, gospel th- um, musicians yes, or more programs, yeah, yeah. if I'm aware, I'm sorry, them, as in here, I'm talking of the West Side. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Have you guys ever wished to have event centers so that Mubi or? Yeah. Yeah. So that because there is yeah. none, that is why you resort to yes. the churches. So we always have to resort to the churches to give us the auditorium so that we use. But we are praying. I believe that uh, there is time for everything. Mm. In God's own time, even if it's not an MP or any president bringing that to us, we in the gospel industry or those in the industry can bring up an event center for our programs. Okay. Yeah, I believe that will nice happen one. someday. Nice one. And ever since uh, we all realized, for, for so many years, for about 20 years, we've all realized we don't have an event center yeah. because the Jubilee Grounds is gone. Yeah. For about 25 years, CNC is gone. Yeah. The other big hotels with, you know, auditoriums are charging huge yeah. amounts of yeah. money. Now, what have you, I mean, the gospel fraternity, okay. what have you done to make the, the the leaders of the city or the region hear your voice in terms of events grounds, um, any any clarion call that has been placed, anything okay. like that. Um, on one particular show, I don't know if you wouldn't mind. I mentioned that okay. uh, I think on Spice uh, FM Gospel Express, I've heard the pundits always talking about that. I remember they talked about that. That's an event center, they made that call up. That's one. Uh, For almost a month, anytime they went to their show, they would talk about that, that the city should be able, the leaders of the city should be able to give us an event center for our programs. For that one, the gospel industry, uh, I think, uh, Edabetel, Mausi, Brahmans, uh, Bismarck, is this a swan? Uh, on that show, they okay. talked about it. So uh, it's only on that show. What happens with your socials? Have you made a call for your followers to also back you on this? Uh, actually, because honestly, I feel <laughs> the musicians, you people need a place more than us. That's so true. if you are not that's placing true. any call. That's true. Um, I think we have to. We have to do that. So... Uh, since we have music out here, we have Gamro also here, mm. we have the people here, the executives are here, so we we'll channel it through them so that okay. I think that awareness will be made and then the event center will be right, for right. us. Right, right. Uh, quickly, before we talk about your music, someone sent me a question that I should ask you. <laughs> so the person is asking, uh, the last time we saw a demonstration hit the oil city, that is yeah. Takendi, Takradi deserves better, yeah. where we had youth, you know, march from here to the uh, WRCC, okay. just to let the regional minister hear them. That our roads are spoiled, this, that, that. We don't have lights. We don't this, we don't this, we don't that. I want to find out from you. It looks like I could barely see any of gospel. the gospel acts in it. <laughs> Is it for fear yeah. that your people might think <laughs> you are being political or you just don't care? It's not that we don't care. So why didn't any of you partake? Um... I can't speak for all of them. Why didn't you partake? Uh, Because on that day, I learned you were here. (laughs) I looked at the calendar. I knew you were here. I spoke to somebody very close to me. Uh, The person said you were here. So why didn't you join? You didn't want, you know, people coming at you that 
oh, gospel, this, this, that, for fear of political tax. Was that why you stayed out of it? <sighs> Did I say yes or no? <laughs> I'm asking you a question. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you just wanted honestly, to stay away from political tax. Honestly, honestly. Mm. Um, I don't have any reason for not joining. Ah. Uh, but the truth is, said you okay now? Ah, mangari, mangari, patro, mangari. You know, uh, Ghanaian is um, You just didn't want to, to be tagged yes, with any political. Tax, yeah. That's why Mistakes, you stayed away from it. They just come up that would the way it would the way it, and mm. in the end, I'm uh, sure I said someone criticize it. Yeah. Meanwhile. It's for our own betterment and mm. the betterment of the city. But to be rich and work here. You wanted to just be safe. Uh, nice one. Team. God willing, tomorrow <laughs> inside Word of Life Assemblies of God and Nache at exactly 5 p.m. Tell us what's happening. Um, so, actually, God's people gathering again uh, to meet their maker. Uh, I always say, anytime you are coming for awakening experience, don't look out for the artist on the bill. Mm. Look out for God. Nice. And what you want to experience. That's all. Mm. Uh, I'm trusting God that he will visit his people. Nice one. He will give us a word. The broken heart said will be encouraged. Oh, I need that. I need to be there. Uh, those who are staying away from the gospel, staying away from God, will come back to God. Mm. And we'll all join hands and then give God praise. Nice one. So why should I come? I've, maybe I've not been a part of it for the past two years. This yeah. is the third. Yeah, third. Why should I be there? You have to be there because I believe God wants to see you. Okay. God wants to see me. Yeah. Nice one. Any side attraction? Uh, we'll be having some fathers around since it's happening on a Father's Day. Nice. We're having some fathers in the music industry around. We're having some men of God around. And through our worship, through our praise, time of the word to ministrations and other stuff, they will also minister to us. They will impact. They will also bless us as fathers. Though we have our biological fathers who also be coming around, I believe these fathers who are in ministry with us have gone a long way. Yeah. So pieces of advice, impact, and some pronunciations mm. of blessings upon our lives. Mm. We take us far. Nice one. Thank you so much. I am seeing, uh, is it Jack Alolome? Yeah. I'm seeing, oh, my own brother, Eski. <laughs> I see Eski. And Kwekute, yeah. I love the man. Wow. Tell him. I, <laughs> First time witnessing his performance. Like, you can shout like that. <laughs> you have voice like that. Oh, he's I love, good. I, he's I love him. As for you, like I said, small but mighty. <laughs> I know what you can do. I simply cannot wait. And it's an, you know, intimacy with God, right? Yeah. Yes. And the time is 5 p.m. 5 p.m. 5 Any red carpet? Yeah. What time does it start? Exactly 4 p.m. 4 p.m. red carpets. Okay. It's not like TGMU, 4 p.m. on time. So please, make a date with us, God willing, tomorrow, the 16th of June, 2024. Sunday, of course, after the fufu and everything, Yay. then you come. Dress nice. The house of God. Dress nice. It's absolutely free. Yeah. It's great, free. Great. Joy says, come. Let's celebrate our fathers. Let's, you know, have intimacy with God. So any final words you've got to tell people out there watching you? Uh, I just want to tell everybody watching that come and experience God. Whatever mm. it is, just come and pour out your heart to God. Mm. Uh, I believe that when we talk to God, He listens. Mm. So as far as He listens, come and just pour out your heart mm. to Him. Mm. It is you and just God. It is you and just God. So make a date with us, God willing, tomorrow. 5 p.m. inside Word of Life Assemblies of God Church inside Anaje. Thank you so much for your time here, Lady Joy. And I simply cannot wait to see you doing the watching tomorrow. Thank you so much for your time.